Hey guys, my name is Evan, and today I'll be reviewing my Lego Zwei Longinus. So, separating the parts of my Lego Zwei Longinus, we have the chip layer disc and the tip. Now, this is an old GT Bay, but I really wanted to do a review on it. Because I have just recently made it, and I wanted to do a review, so here it is. We'll start with the chip. This is the um, Zweilonginus chip. Very simple, and it has two studs for teeth, and a cool yellow and blue design. And for the layer base, this is Y. Now, this has the, lay, um, the weights integrated into it. And so these represent the giant metal dragons and then the little blue blades up here. And overall it looks pretty cool. So you can insert your chip into here. And there you have the white laundry disc. Then you have your forge disc, which is Drake. Now Drake is really, really heavy and holds a hole in the middle for my gimmick, my bursting gimmick. But so when you line it like this, you see these parts, which are supposed to be metal, I guess align with these metal heads and these sides are a lot heavier than these sides of course so it makes for a pretty big impact when they um, smash into another bay and then we have the driver which is spiral I'm not sure if it's a dash driver or anything but this is a purple spiral and it has the same um, bursting gimmick that I have on my two-part chassis base like glide Ragnarok and stuff so how it works is you have your forge disc and your tip pushes through and it connects and it connects right there and this is Zwei Longinus a fully assembled I think it looks pretty pretty cool and yeah I really love the colors and everything so yeah this is just a little bit of a short review on my Lego Zwei Longinus so thank you guys for watching this video Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!